Hello everyone and welcome back to my playthrough of Itora. Um, we'll get straight into it. So this is Chimali. Um, so we'll follow this right along and get going. So what have we got here? More lush and verdant lands. The last episode that I covered, um, we were very much in a spider's cave and it was pretty nasty and scary. This looks quite nice and lush and a bit of a happier place by the looks of things. In a woodland area with lots of grass and greenery, but now these are kind of hopping kangaroo type demon things. Right, we'll dispatch these, we'll dispatch that. Can we get up here? I waste too much time trying to. Oh, yes, maybe. Okay, we'll keep going. Get that fly. It really is, I can't underline it enough. It's such a pretty game, this. I really do love the aesthetic they went for. Kill that thing too. And the controls really, it really is tight. It feels nice, not sluggish or sloppy. Kill that thing too. Now this thing is horrible. Yes, got it. It's secretly hiding from us. It's not gonna beat us though. And we keep going, right. Can we get up on the left there? I wanna get up to that ledge, yeah. So then we've got a chest. Okay. I keep on hoping for one of those orbs in those chests now. Since we started getting orbs, I really want an orb. Okay. What may do with those shards? Okay, get this one. One slight hit. Now if we go down there, are we going to get killed or let's have a look at the map? Mm, it's not really clear. Okay, I'm going to jump over there for now. We're through. Oh, oh, yeah, and we made it. Oh, those bouncy things are tough. Right, kill that. Oh, this reminds me of the plants from Mario. See, it does feel a little bit like Mario, this animal we'll crouch. Yeah, we can crouch underneath it and we'll still get hit. Ouch. Okay. Let's just check if there's anything here. No, nothing there. Really don't want to get killed by this fly thing. Now, I can we get behind him? Yes. That's a cheeky way of killing him. There you go, top tip when you come across those, just get behind. He's a bit out, I think it's wise. That was a press of the LB. Ah, uh, and a cheeky, ah. Oh. Quick save, could have saved that, it's okay. Right, let's keep going. And we'll kill this dude. Yeah, I recently found out that Grimbart, of uh, Grimbart Tales, Grimbart actually means um, a badger in German, which is a strange one. Don't see many badgers around, but um, yeah, that's where they get their name from. Right, so can we get past here? No, it looks like we're stuck. So what can we do here? Okay, I reckon if we go, let's try and ascend. Yeah. Uh, I dislike those things. Now I wish I had a projectile. That would be nice. Let's have a look if there's something this way. Mm, doesn't look like it. No, it looks like a bit of a dead end. We're going to waste too much time there. Ooh. It does take a moment to hey, crouch. Deal with that, deal with that. Get up here. Oh, 
Oof, they're really turning it up with those horrible things. Key, the key with those is patience, and you can, as you can already tell, my patience is fairly limited. But I try, I try hard to be patient. I need to slow myself down on these walkthroughs. Right here we go. Slow and steady wins the race. All right, okay, let's get down from there. I saw one of those leaping frog kangaroo demon things. Alright, there's two of them. Hey, hey, hey. Let's just get them. Oh, I've already been hit. Just dispatch. Okay, so you can crawl walk type of thing. Uh, yeah, you can get it like that. Yes. That's a nice way to do it as well. Just crawl right up to them and use your slight jab. Should finish them off. chicken and leave that one and see where we're going from the map okay now if I jump to the left is it going to be something there to catch me that's the big question let's try it. whoa okay you can jump onto those rings and oh not miss that one let's try that again okay okay you've got to be pretty affirmative with your jumps there we are and we're across Going up and up and up. Patience, patience. So yeah, if you press diagonally on the control pad down, you can do a crawl. And that when you're sure you can get close to the beat. I feel like I'm very high up now. I'm not one for heights. Okay. Right, these jump, jumpy things there. Gonna get it. Right, so three hits and they're down. Okay, patience, patience. Okay, just about managed to get on here. I nearly missed that platform to jump onto. You know what, I'm gonna do a bit of healing. There we are while we're there. Okay, now that seems to be wanting to point us that way. Let's go that, actually, let's look at the map. Hmm. I'm tempted to have a look left first. Let's have a look left. Let's see what we can see. Those things look vicious. My gut feeling is that jumping on those is going to kill me. Or maybe we can find that together if they do. Yep, they do. Right, we're not doing that again. This is where I'm very happy that it doesn't have lives, but a life meter. We are still going. 
of you. Right, let's go this way and have a look. Right, save. I always manage to seem to save it just at the point uh, when I've just given myself a massive healing. Right, Chimali this way. Looks like we're looking good. So you need to try and time the healing if you're going to do it for when you're not going to come to a save point. That seems a bit pointless. Okay, kill that guy. We are finally fully above ground. I like that. Get very claustrophobic. I'm not one for spelunking either. I'm going deep underground. Here we go. Right. We're meeting our cat. Heart. Home sweet home. Welcome to Chimali. Looks quite inviting. Who's this dude? Right, tall. Welcome, <coughs> move along. Okay, not that friendly after all. Something out of the Hobbit. Okay, we can go up here. Enter. <laughs> oh, two masks. Sipatel or Sipati hasn't seen before. Do you perhaps carry any petrified echoes? Let's see. Okay, you can help us make use of them. Additional cure, stronger cures. Well, let's get an additional cure. Okay, do those. Ah, okay. Looks like we probably don't have enough yet. So, let's leave. Okay, so he's like a little shop dude. Reminds, uh, welcome to Chimali, achievement unlocked. Okay, I saw animals dripping with dark ooze. Mm. Is the plague coming? Good question. Mm. Oh, the mountain spider's acting up. World <laughs> tree. Oh, is it in danger? Mm. Well, reduce foraging to a minimum. Needs to assess it. Really this like looks it. like a real motley crew of furry creatures. Cute but weird. I believe they're just safe for now. enough for the cat to climb up there I'm sure. Alright, do we need to yeah, let's do a quick save there. Quick save, nice. And carry on. Who's this guy to talk? Hmm. Okay, he's very talkative as well. Is impeccable. Hmm. Nayata. Nayata. Oh, you've made it. Never mind, Chief Grouchy Pants here. Take a look at those doodles. Yeah, very nice doodles. Forbidden ruins. Hmm. Okay, well, hopefully that's a sign. Ah. <laughs> Okay. Looks like we're causing a bit of an argument between these two. Don't 
that almost looks like a kind of a squirrel gremlin thing. Please drop by afterwards. Cunning. <laughs> Marital dispute. Nice. Mm. No time. It's like we're gonna go straight through the forest somehow. Leave. Okay, so. Oof, what's this? Into a cave? Let's have a look at a cave. I know you've got a talking axe or hammer or something as well. Welcome to Nana and Tate's Feathersmith Business Travelers. Fetch us some pale feathers and shards for you. Clobber them into your headgear as a charm for good health and stamina. Ah, this looks like a similar kind of shop, dude. Increase health. Not enough materials. Okay. We're not there yet. So we'll carry on on our journey. Oh, these kind of cow, sheep, warrior things, they're cute, and this dude. Hey, yo. Okay. Chickens are around. Okay, she doesn't want to talk at all. What's this, this guy going to say? Okay. Maybe this looks like we're going on to the next world. I wonder if that's going to be our hub then. Might very well be. Nahu Falls, okay, looks like we're going to Nahu Falls. Whoa! He is not friendly. Yeah, these bulls are kind of a bull rhino warrior thing, and I feel like he's gonna. Yeah. Huh. See you later. Whoa, there's another one there. Oof. So, should we try and go up or down? Yeah, I think we're forced to go down initially. Yeah, let's go down. To avoid getting shot. Do our crawl. Ah, ain't gonna be that easy. Can we walk past it? Let's try and walk past it, see what it does. Yeah, we can walk past it. Get in from behind. Seems a bit unfair on him, but yeah. Dispatch this one for good measure, in case we come back this way. Let's have a look, look. Yeah, okay, we're still discovering. Ah! Okay, that's some of that shard stuff. So that explains that. That looks like we can use that to buy increased health, etc., in those shops. That'll come in handy. So those are the three hits. Right, I'm going to kill you this time. Mate. Here we are. Easy. 
Oh, that killed you. Alright, so don't do that. I thought there might be a platform or something down there, clearly not. Chances. Anything up here? No. Oh, that was harsh. Right. Clearly hanging from those things is not a guarantee of safety. Right. this time. You really want to hurt you bad. Okay, so get past that. Let's crawl. Let's crawl our way. That is a handy mechanic. I won't lie. Right, so we're past that. I'm sorry, matey. We are going to kill you. Take that. Is there something down here? No, it looks like a dead end. So we can make our way across here. What? Ball? Ball? Okay. So it seems those things are best avoided. So 986 of those shard things, so I think it was either 1,000 or 1,500 we need to see, or maybe even 1,250. Maybe we can start getting stuff now. No. Okay, so you can't really wall jump on this, can you? Try and... no. Okay, so we can't make our way up there. Huh. Are we stuck? I think we're stuck. Let's have a look at the map. go down the way. Oh, that looks like a nice chest. I think I want that. Oh no, one of those bug spitting things. Right now, I think the tactic is to lure them down to where you can get them. It seems to work.
to be fair, it could be a girl or a boy like that. Spiritual goo by the way. Holds to charge a powerful attack. There we go. That's what I've been wanting. Fantastic. So I felt that that was missing. I was hoping that was going to. Yes. That should come in really handy. Brilliant. Okay, so I we I saw some of those bricks in other places. I'm, I wonder if we can smash them now. They were smaller than that. A similar type of thing, but smaller. That was a small thing to be into. Oh, slightly secret chest. Not that secret. Process. Let's have a look. I want to have a look this way. Anything? No. Okay. This is good, and we go back out the way. like a long gap and can we make that? Hey, that's a bit rude. Right, let's just give us a little bit more life, I think. This sound. Right. Okay. Okay, we can make it across. Nice. It's relatively generous with its save points. It does. It feels like the game is trying to help you out all the time. It is not trying to be brutal. It, 
the difficulty is not brutal in this game. I can say for a fact that I'm pretty convinced most of the time when, I'm, when I am getting killed it is absolutely my fault for my complete lack of patience. Not the games at all. But that's me, I need to learn to be more zen. Which I think this game helps with. It's a very relaxing, nice little game to play. Right, here we go. All right, so we're getting back to where we were. We should now be able to use our extra special power move to get through this. And here we go. Nice. Let's see, that's satisfying. Let's make it through there. That's it. So thanks very much for joining me for the second part of this journey. And um, yeah, please do like, subscribe, comment, and um, see you for the next one for part three.